Uh, okay, uh, it's gonna sound a bit uh, shocking to many, but uh, I believe I have to do this because uh, I've got to bear the responsibility for what happened. At my last time, I said that uh, the president is gonna die on the 17th of um, October in this year 2017. And um, what happened after that has proved and shown that the president misunderstood what I say. Because I remember saying that if he wants to prolong his life, he has to go before God. And um, having said that, I thought he was going to understand it and begin to go before God, but instead he went uh, and uh, maybe dragged me, you know, into, into the courts and at the same time into, into, into prison for 55 days. So I really want to take responsibility by saying, uh, Mr. President, I'm really sorry uh, that you misunderstood what I said. But you know what, sir, I am not apologizing for what I said. What I said still remains and it still stands if you do not do anything about it. So having said that, having taken a responsibility, I believe it's everybody's responsibility to be responsible for whatever they would have said and for whatever they would have uh, actually done. And for you, sir, I strongly believe that you need to take responsibility for the nation of Zimbabwe. We are where we are because we have made it to be so. There are many things we can be listing, which I believe you need to take responsibility over. It was only last year when it told us to say that the nation lost $15 billion. That is a lot of money. And thereafter, you just but went very, very quiet and silent. Like I am saying, there is all the need to take responsibility for what one says. But for you, you do not want to take responsibility. You also need to take responsibility. Recently, I was in Mazowe, and your wife has chased over 200 people, 200 families from where they have been staying for a very long time. And this, these people have been your own people who moved in, but now you are chasing them away. And I saw a three month old, not, not a three week old uh, girl. And, 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 and it's a pathetic situation as to where she is staying with her parents. And it's something that you need to take responsibility of her. The nation is going down, the economy is going down, and there is no sign of it rising up in any way. You need to take responsibility. I do not know what you want Zimbabweans to say when you are gone. But I strongly believe that for the sake of your name, because the Bible says that a, better, a good name is better than riches. I do not know what you want between money and riches, or money and your name. Your name should be very, very important at a time such as this.